Yeah. Place. So cool. You guys, I mean, really, you said such kind of things. And meeting you so long ago. And, and all the other house concerts that have played. In fact, some of you guys are here. That's fantastic. Um, and I was telling Kevin that I, I, I love, and I've seen it in a few parts of this country, where it's not a selfish thing. It's not a me, me. It's, it's, it's all sharing and uh, celebrating all the other house concerts that are going on. And like, hey, we have this weekend. You have that weekend. And, and, and it's just, it keeps it all alive. It keeps the musicians playing. But it also, it shows that there's no... Um, well, there's, there's no, you're not greedy about it. You're, you're loving the sharing. If you have a beautiful place in this gorgeous landscape, as uh, Kevin told me, he's like, we built it to entertain. We built it to share. I mean, how selfish you guys would be if you didn't. <laughs> Thank goodness you are not. <laughs> Here's some I have not played in maybe four years or so. I wrote this song. A buddy of mine is a guitar player for a big heavy metal band back in the 90s and early 2000s called Shinedown. And he, uh, he was married to uh, Ronnie Van Zant of, uh, of Skinner, his daughter. And uh, he made crap loads of money and, uh, you know, too soon, too fast, and too much, and this and that. And ended up driving his BMW into some guy's pool in LA. And, we were sitting there in Nashville talking about stuff, and he was just like, man, I screwed up so much stuff. If I could tell you all the things and how I would apologize to my ex-wife. And, and I was listening to him, and uh, it, it became this song. Sweet woman. <laughs> 